Um, before we start this video, I want you guys to follow Slypo on Instagram. He's trying to get to 10,000 followers, and we want him to get there as fast as possible. He posts early updates on his videos, customs, and you also have a chance to talk to him personally. And you probably want that, so please go follow him. And yeah, see you later. Yo, what is going on guys? Sly here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a Freddy Frostbear plush using a Blue Freddy plush. So yeah, um... Let's, let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is cut out this muzzle using my desewing tool, and we're going to replace it with this fabric. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. Alright, so I cannot get the nose up for the life of me. There's something really holding it in. It's like sewn or glued in there. It's impossible to take out without destroying the pattern. So I'm gonna just use this thing and cut out the pattern with the blue fabric. Yeah. Alright, so I actually tried a little bit longer and apparently the fabric was tied around the nose, but we got it off. It's good. And now we're gonna move on to the pattern. Okay, so I had made the muzzle and uh, put the thing behind it, the little sheet, uh, to give the, the shape, and now I'm just sewing it onto the face, so yeah, let's do this. We're done with the mouth, it is all sewed on, it looks pretty good. Um, now we're gonna put on the nose, and ye. Okay guys, so I put on the eyes and the nose, and now I'm going to do the eyebrows and the ears, just by using the same dark blue felt I use for, or not felt, fabric for the nose. Um, and yeah, let's just do that super easy. Okay, I cut out the smallest little shapes for the eyebrows, and hot glued them on, and now time for the ears. All right, so I got the ears on, the eyebrows, it is looking pretty good. And yeah, so now we're gonna take off the hat and get the pattern from that, and yeah, let's, let's, let's do it. Okay, so I got all this cut out, and I'm gonna put on the hat using the same dark blue fabric I used for here so yeah let's do it all right got the pattern for the hat cut out and now I'm gonna sew it together and slap it on top of his hat okay so I actually added um, these regular eyes that look a lot better uh, I just cut out the bubble eyes and then put the um, black domes and the circles and stuff like that but yeah it looks pretty good so now we're gonna move on to the body oh real quick I cut out these little like strips of uh, fabric to make icicles to put on the ears and yeah, that'll go there, and then we'll do the mistletoe on the hat, and finally move on to the bottom. 
Okay, so I got the um, icicles on the ears, and now I cut out these little uh, red circles and the leaves for the mistletoe on the hat, so let's put that on. Okay, so as you can see, I used the pattern from the hands to sew on this one, and now I'm going to do the other side, and I'm going to do the same with these, and then put on the bow tie, and yay! Okay, so now I got both sides on, boom, and now I'm just unsewing the belly, to get the right fabric in there and then I'll move on to the feet. I'm just doing the belly first so I can just put on the bow tie real quick and get that out of the way. And just like that, the stomach is glued out and on there and now let me put on the bow tie. Boom! Okay, I got that foot on and now time to do the next one and then, I mean, the last thing we need to do is the icicle. All right, and that is the feet. Now we're just gonna do the icicle and we will be done. And just like that, we are all done with Freddy Frostbear. This looks pretty good, not even gonna lie. Got his icicle on, everything looks really, really good. So yeah guys, if you did enjoy this tutorial, it's um, it's one that you guys can do pretty easily if you do want to follow along. But if you did like the tutorial, make sure you guys do like and subscribe. Um, follow me for more content like this. And um, yeah, I mean, we got a lot of other upcoming customs like Dreadbear and stuff like that. So um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this one. And uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram because I've been posting about this guy for... A little while now uh, before actually showing him on a YouTube video so yeah follow me on Instagram link in the description